Hello again. Well, as you all know, I, I mess about quite a lot with the car, jacking it up all the time. And um, whenever you're jacking up a car, uh, you want to find out, first of all, where the jacking points are. And on the Mondeo, there are points that are basically on the frame rails where the seals join to the car. Um, the problem, of course, is that if you jack many times over the years, that eventually even those jacking points can have a tendency to bend and distort and uh, get destroyed by the, uh, the jacks and the axle stands. So I've been looking for a way in which I might be able to protect the seals a little bit better. Reading the Haynes manual, they talk about creating a block of wood with a groove in it, um, which uh, sounds interesting, but I haven't got really time for that. But I was doing a search online and I found uh, a couple of rubber blocks that might be interesting. First of all, let's look at what Ford provide us in the way of a, a jack. And if you have a look at this jack, um, you'll see that first of all, it is shaped. It's got a bit of a U like this, which will feel, fit uh, over the seal quite nicely and a flat piece that will go onto the bodywork. When the axle stands came, they came plain with no adapters, grooves, nothing. So this would go hard onto, a, onto the seal. Similarly with the trolley jack, it's just a piece of metal and uh, that causes damage. So I went online and I found um, some rubber blocks. So first of all, there's this round one which fits quite nicely onto my trolley jack uh, and it has a nice groove in the middle as well. Then I got what's called a universal uh, axle stand protector and um, because this has a bit of a bend in it, it doesn't quite fit, so I cut the ends off the uh, block uh, so it fits nicely on top of the axle stand. And I just want to see how these perform now underneath the car. So before jacking up the car, always uh, secure it by chocking at least one of the wheels with bricks or wood um, but don't rely on the handbrake or the gearbox. So let's start with the scissor jack from uh, Ford. So on this occasion, you'll see that there's quite good actually support on the inside there and less likely to uh, damage the frame rail. Next, the trolley jack. Uh, well, it's a little bit distorted, but uh, it appears to be supporting the inside of the uh, car fairly well uh, and spreading itself around. I think that probably would help actually uh, stop the, uh, the frames uh, from distorting. There's the axle stand. Going to slide the rubber block in like so and then we're just going to gently drop the jack down so it's now on the axle stand and let's have a closer look of how that looks and it is supporting that frame quite well I don't think it will cause the rail to distort. Okay, so there we are. Um, I tried them out. Um, what do I think of these rubber blocks? Well, I think they potentially will stop the, uh, the frame rails from distorting and, and folding down. Um, only time will tell. Um, they're certainly, I would say, better than not having them. And let's face it, they're quite cheap as well, so they're worth buying anyway. Um, let me know what you think, actually, if you've got any experience, if you've tried these sort of things uh, yourself, um, leave some comments below. I'll be uh, really pleased to read about that. Um, if you like this video, obviously give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, well, there we go. Um, and if you like what I do, then please subscribe because I would appreciate it as well. Anyway, there we are to the next one. Bye for now.